Hi there Transform fans, this is Kids My Flat 1313 bringing you another video review. This time I've got for you Transformers War for Cybertron War for Cybertron, yes Optimus Prime. Now this is a very nice figure very very nice. It's got his gun accessory that he comes with um, you can have it like this or you can have it like that whichever way We'll pull that off for transformation, but before we get the transformation, on the back, I've noticed this yesterday, there's a big gaping hole. Now, I was thinking, hmm, how can you fill that in? Well, when it comes to the knee pads, if you rotate the knee pads round, it will fill that gap in. I don't know if this is the transformation, but it, it just makes a bit of sense. And he's got backlights, and it fills in that a lot better, so... He's got backlights then, which looks really nice, better, uh, a lot better and nicer. Um, but yeah, that is Optimus Prime in his vehicle mode. Not as big as the leader class, I mean, that's like colossal. Huge. Gigantic. Whatever. Anyway, we'll get on to this. Um, so to transform it, you want to pull this down like that. Pull this out like that. Just extend that. Pull this bit, this side panel, out and down. To the same as the other side. Out and down. Get this blue bit and there's a little clip here, you just want to unclip it from the wheel clip. Oh, there we go. And it it's attached to the hands as well, which as you can see, it just come off. There we go. And then you just want to rotate this bit round, but before you just want to lift them up. Before you do that, you want to lift that round. That's what I wanted to say. And you can twirl this round, spin that round, like you peg that in, spin it round, spin this round, peg that in. So you've got that. So you've got there. Then you can open the legs up. And this is where you can open these knee pads out a bit. Extend. Fold knee pad against the leg to make it straight so it won't move forward and backwards. Do the same on the other side. Extend. Rotate. Open. Open. Pull back. Whatever you want to do. This is how I like to do it. Pull back. Open these out for a sec pull the legs or pull the wheels round, that's what I meant to say. Round, flip this up, like that. There's his legs. Oh, I just want to pull these hands out like that. And then you can open these bits out. Or pull these out from the they peg into the front. You just want to unpeg them. Like that and then you want to flip them up there like that and then you can open pull these wheels back and that will allow you the space to pull these hands out like that rotate this bit round only that bit because then the rest gets folded up to form the legs get this Twirl it round, and this just pegs into the rest of it. So you've got peg, peg in. Got to line it up and then peg it in because then it'll go in properly. There we go. And then with these little bit, the uh, little pokey out bits, just fold them round and wrap them round his waist. Pull the head out. Nice prime head there going on. Very nice. Rotate the hands. Just fold all these up so you got that in there and the thing on the side like that. Get these fists, rotate there, rotate hand out. Rotate, rotate and pull out. And it'll click into place. Now what I like to do, because I normally put him on the shelf, is there's a little like peg there, just there, and there's a hole in the back of Prime's head and I've just shoved that in there and it's got used to it and it's now trying to push its way out but it does go in and it supports his head a lot 
you can st stand him up like that. Now, the gun can go anywhere. You can have it in the side or on his hand. Under his hand. Whatever. Uh, and then, if you fold it up like the little tiny gun, there's a little slot there. And if you spin him round, there is a little peg there. Just there. And you just want to peg that hole into the peg. There we go. And that is War for Cybertron Optimus Prime in his robot mode. I love this. It's a nice representation of Prime as a deluxe figure. Um, I don't have the, the War, for, uh, War for Cybertron game, but people have been telling me it is amazing. And I will take it by that. That's why I'm getting the figures. Um, it has also been called these sort of figures Generations, but I'm just going to call these figures War for Cybertron. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video review, and please subscribe.